Good morning, Frank Church. I am Mr. Dennis. I'm the principal here. Um, and on behalf of the staff, I would like to welcome all of you to a new school year. We are really excited to have you be a part of our community. Um, in a few minutes, uh, Mr. Bale and Ms. Camino will be talking to you about some specific rules um, that we wanted you to be aware of. For me, um, we are going to continue the off-campus um, during lunch for sophomores, juniors, and seniors. Um, the last two years has been a success. The one thing I ask is that you are responsible adults in the community. If we are not, then I will take that privilege back, but um, I don't expect any issues. If you have any questions, please come down to the office, talk to me, talk to Miss Deb, um, or any adult in or at Frank Church, you will see that we are here to help you. Again, on behalf of Frank Church, welcome to a great school year. Welcome back, Frank Church students. I'm Mr. Bell. I am one of the vice principals here. Uh, my alphabet is A through K this year, and I'm super excited to have you back in the building. Um, those of you who've been Frank Church students in the past, welcome back. We're glad to have you here. The new ninth graders, new to our school, this is a great place to be. I'm so looking forward to being part of your journey here. Hi, Frank Church. So happy to see you. What an amazing day. Super excited. I am Mrs. Cabina, and I am L through Z. Um, both of us are here to be a part of your journey, so please don't hesitate to reach out. Just a reminder, we are here to support you. We will be talking to you. We'll be in your classrooms because that is what we do. We are a community, and we are here to be a part of your journey, so welcome. A few things to cover just to make sure we start our school year off on the right foot. Um, let's talk about our use of cell phones here at school. Um, we as your admin team are really going to be supporting your classroom teachers and their cell phone policies they put in place. They'll be covering those with you this week and reviewing them over the next few weeks so they kind of become locked down and ingrained in what you do within your classroom. As far as taking your cell phones outside of the classroom, we're going to have a little bit of a new policy here. Nature is going to call. We know that you're going to need to use the bathroom throughout a classroom period. When you leave your classroom, cell phones are left in the classrooms. So we have a no cell phone policy in all of our bathrooms. We have a no cell phone policy in the hallway during class periods. Um, so please keep that in mind. Um, your teachers will be discussing it with you, Mrs. Cabina, and I will be reinforcing it um, in the hallways when we see you. Cell phones do have appropriate use at school. Your teacher is going to share those um, with you, so just keep those in mind. Dress code. There's not a lot in the dress code at this point in time. Um, please just dress in a way that you're comfortable to learn. Also, the, the line we do hold is no drug references, no alcohol references, um, no gang affiliations or references, and those we take from the Boise Police Department. So if they have deemed something inappropriate, we will be having that conversation with you, and we will ask you to no longer wear those items of clothing. So no drug references, no alcohol references, um, no red hats or blue hats, no LA please at this time, no bandanas at all, not hanging from a pocket, wrapped around anything, not on your head. Um, so please respect those pieces and come ready to learn. We do not want to become the bathroom police. Mrs. Cabina and myself, that is the least favorite part of our day. We know nature calls, you're gonna need to use it. But let's be smart. When you use the bathrooms, let's have a purpose. Go take care of your business as quick as you can, and let's move on out of the bathroom. Um, it's never fun for one of us to have to come in and say, hey, what's going on in here? When we know there should be one or two things happening, and that is it. <laughs> so a couple people in the bathroom at a time, be purposeful, um, in, out, take care of your business. We won't come and bug you during that time if that's what's happening. Thank you, appreciate it. Mr. Dennis already talked to you about lunchtime. Ninth graders stay on campus, 10, 11, 12 can leave. Just a reminder, the only door that you can enter in and out of at Frank Church is that front door. You must have your ID ready. You will be getting temporary ID cards that you can use. You must have your Frank Church ID to come in and out of the building. You also need it to enter the building if you are late or to use the city bus or to check in if you're tardy. So hold on to those IDs. You will get your um, permanent ID once we have picture day on September 1st. 
in and out front doors only do not go out of the side doors or your, you will lose that privilege to leave campus for the day have a wonderful day we are so excited you are all back and enjoy Good morning, Frank Church. I'm Mr. Jeans, and this year I'm going to be running a lunchtime uh, intramural sports program. You may see some QR codes around the school. Go ahead and scan that, and you'll have a choice of four different sports that we're going to start from this year. Uh, mostly outdoor sports to start. Um, we'll move indoor as the weather gets a little bit colder. You guys give me the input of what you want to do, and I'll do my best to get those things out there, and I look forward to seeing you at lunchtime.